man every single year omnivice seems to be getting better and better and this year is no exception so gtc 2023 uh, they showed some of the highlights and it's been amazing to see the progress that uh, omnivice is doing in terms of uh, physics and the lighting real-time lighting both with our uh, uh, simulations and uh, just using ai as a whole you know the effects uh, the physics part of it it's been getting better and better and we all most of us that were in my community even you guys who are listening to me are mostly familiar with uh, the unreal engine uh, for your short films but i tell you uh omnivus is becoming one uh, one of those options that i keep leaning more and more towards as it's getting better and better you know uh physics engine is amazing <laughs> first of all and uh they are using it of course for robotics and uh you know just uh, industrial usage is seeing a big you know like adaptation of this but also adaptation of ai character animation with our in uh, audio to face uh, it's amazing and i highly highly encourage you guys please please try it give it a chance when you get a chance because uh, i mean in, the unreal engine is awesome but it's not as easy to get into as omniverse omniverse is way easier to get into so please when you get a chance download it from uh, the nvidia you know website and give it a try i would love to see what you guys are creating with it I'll continue to test it with uh, my short film to see if I can make some uh, like episodes rendered in uh, Omniverse with path tracing and real-time rendering. And there are some cool things that I also want to do, like when I'm doing uh, educational content for kids, you know. Uh, even you guys, if you are into robotics, I think this is one of those solutions that you probably find very handy. And motion capture too. I mean, it's, it's interesting to see how they're evolving and also incorporating move.ai. There are so many connectors that they're adding to Omniverse. And so for me, the pathway I always use is uh, bring iClone characters into Omniverse for rendering because it's very difficult to render into uh, in using path tracing inside of iClone. And they've actually made a connector from iClone to Omniverse, which makes it much easier.